Hi guys, Laura here from Hedgehog Homestead. Today we are going to the property. We're actually here and I'm going to drive in and just kind of show you what it looks like. It's all overgrown a little bit now. We need to get on the tractor a little bit more and get some things done. But what I'm doing here today is I'm just bringing some compost. And if it isn't so terribly hot, right here in the shade it's 93 degrees but it's supposed to be 100 with an index today, of a heat index today of uh, um, 110. So we'll see how much I can handle. I do have some water in the tiny house that I can grab, um, but uh, it is hot. So um, I definitely wanted to get the compost from the house to the land so we can get it in our compost or, or that we have here on the land. So we'll be doing that. I don't know if I'll be adding leaves to that. We'll just see what I can tolerate in the heat um, so we'll get as much done as we can and if it's not bad at all we'll pick some blackberries so let's drive in and see what things look like we're literally on our property already it goes down that way as well but this is our driveway into our property and it looks like I need to get Mabel out here to mow our entryway a little bit because she is growing over. There's our forty-seven thousand dollar electric electricity that we don't have hooked up to a house yet, <laughs> but it's up here. The trees we saved last year when we were mowing. They're a little bit yellow because it's been so dry here. Chris mowed along the side of the roads while we were here last time. Before he started working. So you can see that everything's still nice and green. Uh, thank God for the humidity. I'm going to pull up to our compost pile and dump that first because I've been smelling that stink smell the whole way here. Oh wow, look at that guys. Um, those big birds, which I think they're chicken hawks, just flew off of this pile. And what they're eating on top of that pile there. But they just flew off of there. They were sitting on there. Okay, so I'm gonna, there's our compost thing over there. I'm gonna put um, some stuff in there. It's so humid. I don't know if you guys can see if you look really close. <laughs> My uh, glasses have fogged over. <laughs> kind of funny. So I'm just gonna set you guys up. get my gloves on here.
Look at that little guy in the compost. Okay, there you go guys, that's what it looks like. I'm not gonna throw anything else on this today. Um, disgusting. Disgusting, look at that sweet potato over there. Sprouting. Dog hair in there, all kinds of goodies. So, that's our compost. Let's get over to our house and wash my hands really good. I'm glad it didn't leak in the bag at all. We'll get over to the tiny house and show you guys that. It's good to come out here and check on things for a while. This is where our house is going right here, guys. Right here in this spot next to our tiny home. And this was where the tiny house was on this pad. Chris and I moved it over here. Um, but that's our tiny home. And let's go inside and see if I can find the keys for it. The tiny house that we were gonna make into a home, um, but we're not anymore because we're going with a barn dominium. Gotta really watch out for snakes right now. Norman's out here with me, enjoying the land. No, well, I can't see any blackberries on things. So I guess we're not picking blackberries today. I'll have to find some next time. So we're gonna go home. Um, I just wanna kinda check things out. I left my keys in, in there in the tiny house. Um, check on uh, all our equipment here. Um, if we don't watch it, we're going to have trees. Oop. Some kind of purple bird was eaten right there. Interesting. little pink flowers over there. Where's our mower? I think it's on the... So I'm just checking everything out, making sure that everything's okay out here while I'm out here. See if Mabel's okay. Still locked up good. Okay, everything looks good. This is our property, folks. 
not so bad out here. Needs a mowing again. <laughs> Once the, uh, they start working on, on the house, we'll be out here a lot more taking care of the land. Um, it's just been really, really hot, and uh, you don't want to spend a lot of time outside, and there's no place, no reprieve from the heat here. Um, so once you're out here, you're dealing with the heat in a big way. So I'm going to grab myself a bottle of water to take home with me. Um, thank you for coming along with me today. Remember, we're chasing our dreams and building this land into a homestead. Go chase yours. And as always, God bless you guys and see you next time. Bye.